There is something about him, isn't there? Hello siblings and welcome back to my channel. As you can see by the title, this video is all about like a school morning routine. I personally am not going back to school. I graduated high school and I'm not going to college. But I know that many of you are going back to school and I think it's really important to know how to get ready really fast so then you get to sleep more and you'll never be late for school again. These are kind of my tips and tricks on how I used to get ready in 10 minutes. For those of you who don't know, I had Bible study every day before school. I had to leave my house at the latest 6.05 and I would usually wake up at like 5.55. So if anyone knows how to get ready in 10 minutes, it's me. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's just get started. A quick morning routine actually is gonna start at night. The more you do at night, the less you have to do in the morning. So every single night before school, even if it is 12.30 a.m. like it is right now, I'm going to take a shower. I have never in my life with school showered in the morning especially because of how long it takes my hair to dry. That is just not even a possibility for me. Next, we are going to pick out my outfit the day before. I am so delirious and undecisive at 5.50 in the morning. And most importantly, I set my socks out because I can never find socks and I don't want to deal with that in the morning. Now I'm ready for bed. That's like every YouTuber's morning routine when they get up an hour early and look all really good for school and they water their plants and all that. That is not how you get ready in 10 minutes. So now I'm gonna actually show you how to get ready in 10 minutes. Oh, now I only have 10 minutes to get ready. If this was actually a video before school, it would definitely be dark, but it's actually like noon, so sorry about it. Okay, here we go. First, I'm just gonna literally sprint into my bathroom. To save time, I turn on the hot water so it gets hot by the time I'm done going to the bathroom and then head over and start washing my face. Right now, I'm using this face wash from Hello Body. I really like this face wash. It makes my face feel like soft. Then I'm just going to casually brush my teeth. Then I'm going to moisturize. Right now, I don't love this moisturizer, but it's the one I have right here. By now, it should have been like five minutes, so then I just change into my outfit. Now it is time for my makeup routine, and this is the part that can really determine how fast you get ready, I feel like, because some people's makeup routine literally takes 30 minutes. If you have a schedule kind of like me, I suggest that you just do it once you get to school and you're either waiting in the parking lot or going to school early into the bathroom and do it. But if you can't, just do it as fast as you can. Remember, it's just school, you don't have to look absolutely amazing every single day. But for me, a typical school day makeup routine is like this. First, I'll start out with my just simple CoverGirl concealer to cover up all of my blemishes. Don't wanna look absolutely trash at school. Of course, I'll use my beauty blender to blend that in. I might use a little powder. This is just a Bare Minerals matte powder, but no guarantee on that one. Then I'm gonna do my eyebrows with just this eyebrow pencil. I have no specific on what I like. This is just the one I have on hand. And then I'll use this clear mascara to keep my very thick, long eyebrows in place. This is my favorite mascara ever because you don't have to use anything to like wash it off. It like peels off with water. And if I'm really feeling it, I'll throw on just a little bit of this Hoola bronzer for my eyeshadow. But honestly, nine out of 10 times when I'm getting ready in the morning, no makeup, I'm just gonna brush out my eyebrows throw on my glasses and then you can't even tell if I'm wearing makeup or not, so then I call it good. Literally my biggest advice for getting ready is to find a makeup routine that is really simple and then we do our hair. I will link a video, if I remember, somewhere up here of less than five minute hair tutorials for back to school from a long time ago. If you guys want me to do an updated one, then let me know in the comments. Once again, it's just school. Don't wake up an hour early just to look good. I mean, maybe like on Fridays or something look good, you know? That's kind of what I did. And this is my go-to hairstyle. Pull back to bun and pull out the hair. And boom, 
I'm ready for school. One more thing to talk about is breakfast. Now, personally, I never ate breakfast before school because I don't ever get hungry till like 11 or 12, which is when lunch was. If you're the type that has to eat breakfast, if your parents are lovely and amazing, maybe they'll make you breakfast for you. To go faster, you could also just grab like an apple or a banana, make a quick smoothie. You could like meal prep your smoothies and just put it in a little container and then you just have to throw it in the blender, put it in a cup and take it to go. You could also grab food on the way. Many fast, easy options. But anyway, yeah, so back when I was in high school, this was my morning routine. I literally got ready in less than 10 minutes every single day. So if anyone knows about it, it's definitely me. Maybe this was helpful, maybe it was just entertaining, I don't know, but the biggest thing to get ready quick is to plan as much as you can the day before. Even if you're tired, make sure you shower and set out your outfit and pick out where you're gonna eat and everything. The less you have to do in the morning, the more sleep you get, that's all I'm saying. Comment down below when you start school and good luck. I don't know what year you're starting, if it's college, high school, middle school, whatever. Good luck. I hope you have a great year. But learn to have a fast morning routine so you can sleep more. Thank you guys so much for watching. My social media is down below, and I'll see you in the next one.